So away we go. The West Tigers beginning their time in NRLW. Such an exciting occasion. They go back to that left-hand side for Curtin. Betty Welch, try scorer, history maker for the West Tigers. And a dream return after 16 months of heartache and plenty of time to work on a celebration like that. Fergo, Bo eats those up for breakfast. She sure does. She loves a little short side opportunity. Scored by the Tigers in their first game in this competition. By the fullback, Bo Betty Welsh. What oh. about the contact? There's real concern here for the replacement front rower, Maddie Jones. She'll be a short HIA candidate. He's already been on kicking duty. The other option is the youngster. And it is Berryman Duff this time, tumbling one down. Oh, Zali Faye making something happen out of nothing. So much talent for the 22-year-old on the left wing for the years. Oh, here we go. Oh, I'll do the limbo, <laughs> Jax. <laughs> Stop it. That's great. Reaping the rewards off that last play kick, I thought that was still a really good position to place the footy, but Zali Faye, She's got to take a lot of ownership over that. That was wonderful. Simon again, this time rocked back by Kezi Apps over the top. Gets involved again here. Quick hand, Sally Faye pins the ears back and has a double. And Parramatta are in front. Stowers. Look at the cutout Donovan who That's now nice. gets on the outside and look how quickly Horn made up the ground. And the ball, worried about the touchline, actually went forward from Donovan. Up over halfway they go with a clean line break to Funga. And there was support that time. Murphy able to make the tackle, an important one on Whitfield. Betty Welsh out of Dummy Half. Togatuki cruises around one, takes on the fullback. Sarah Togatuki with a massive solo effort for the Tigers on their debut in this competition. Off the back of points, Tongatsuki takes them all the way to the 10. Second phase footy. Nicely scooped up behind. In fact, they get a set restart. Ruled that it was touched there by the eel. So George plays it. Fresh count. Lutu out the back. Betty Welsh overlap created and they go back to back the Tigers. They're in dreamland. Nice pass out the back to Leanne Tafunga. But just look at the way she moves. She's so well balanced. Well, we've spoken a couple of times in the call about the timing being off on that edge. She's come on, she's been calm, she made the right decision. Lutu once more, as the outside players, finds Betty Welsh. A little clunky this time, but it might work out. Whitfield said, give it to me. I've found an open passage, and it is all West Tigers now. It's early in the count. Look at Lutu move and flicks it out the back. Overlap created and Tafuga says, I'm having a double. Base up the middle here. They've worked it beautifully and the speech that turns on the Jets. Oh, they won't catch her. Whitfield up the middle, off the wing to score another four-pointer. Maybe one more set after this. As they go through the numbers out on the right-hand side, Betty Welsh for Horn changing the angle. Look at Rakia Horn go! Oh, they didn't lay a hand on her! What a second-half performance this is! Where's the camera, says Rakia? So much to like about this performance first up. It is the West Tigers 36, the Eels 8.